So we want to start by running our application, right? So flask run. Yeah, then let's. Um, I already have the two tabs open, right? One, this one is for. Um, this one is an incognito browser. Let me just log into Starfresh. So this one is for um, the incognito. This one is for normal browser mode. So let me just log in over here. So after logging in, I realize that all the users in this application, mind you, always remember to visit agora-rtm. The reason is this particular repository has both implementations that I have done. One is for Pusher and one is this current one is for purely agora-rtm and um, RTC SDK, right? So let me try to call an offline user. So the user could not be reached because basically they're offline, right? So now let me log in over here to see what will happen. Always remember to visit slash Agora RTM. Yeah. So what happens is that now you see Mopati is online because I just logged in, right? So now let's try to call Mopati again. Wow. So we get an incoming call notification. Let's say I choose to cancel the call. I get call has been cancelled over here. Now let me try to call again. In this case, let me decline the call. The call has the call has been declined, right? And now let's try this last use case where I get to accept the call. So. So after accepting the call, I'm able to establish communication. Now we hear some feedback uh, because uh, both users are on the same laptop and they are not muted. So let me just mute them over here. Now the sound that you might be hearing is basically comes from the recording um, after the music, right? When I unmute one, you hear some kind of feedback. When I unmute, you hear some double feedback. So I hide my camera over here, it disappears. I show over here, it shows. I hide over here, it hides. It shows over here. So just the, the general flow for a video call application with the Agora RTM and RTC SDK. That's the nice thing about it. And let me try turning off my, um, my network to see what will happen. Realize that at the moment it's frozen, the remote user is frozen, right? But now let me turn it on again. Um, realize that it went off. Now let me try to turn my data on again. And that's one thing I noticed. Um, it would automatically reconnect as soon as you have internet back. Yeah, as soon as you get your internet connection back, it's able to re-establish the connection. So that's one cool thing that I realized with the Agora SDK, the ability to reconnect when um, maybe you are temporarily off on the internet or something like that. So that's quite cool with the RTM SDK. Yeah. Now I can end my call over here. Then we end the call over here. So, so this does the general logic. Thank you.